Hawaii, we're fortunate to be surrounded by natural beauty, and our culture and art reflect that. The Hawaii State Foundation on Culture and the Arts is proud to be celebrating our 50th anniversary alongside with the National Endowment for the Arts and their 50th anniversary. The National Endowment for the Arts, they are doing on a national level. If they didn't do what what they did, there is no way we could promote what we're doing at a state level. The Hawaii State Foundation on Culture and the Arts supports artists by commissioning and purchasing works of art from the individual artists. Hawaii was the first state in the nation to pass an art and state buildings law, setting aside 1% of construction appropriations for works of art. The largest amount of pieces in the state collection is housed at the state capitol. We have a Museum Without Walls program that displays works of art in hospitals, schools, libraries, airports, and state buildings so people encounter the works of art in their daily lives. The Art in Public Places program has been an important program because the artworks are shown in public spaces. Public spaces belong to the state. They don't belong to individuals. When people have the opportunity to see their work among others, there is uh, an incentive to move the, the lever of their performance to a higher standard. Many of our cultural resources and support of those perpetuating those cultures come through the National Endowment for the Arts. On behalf of the State of Hawaii, and, uh, I'd like to thank the National Endowment of the Arts for their, their strong support over the years and uh, congratulate them on their 50th anniversary.